to go on there, YouTube. It's been a minute. I do apologize. Um, I am up here at the good old uh, Crystal Lake Recreation Area. There's a little bit of snow on the ground. It's melting. Uh, so it's pretty cool. Nice and cool up here. And uh, yeah, I just come up here to go hiking. I think I'm going to go to uh, Deer Flats today at the Sunset Ridge Trail. Uh, and I'm taking my uh, new little doggo up there. She's held still. Say hello. This is Lulu. Lulu. She's a rescue uh, husky. Um, right now we're um, fostering her and two of her pups. Uh, we're looking for just getting a puppy, but we're uh, trying them out, see how they'll work in our family. Uh, she's got two little girl pups that were that are at home right now, but I, uh, I'm going to take her out and get her some exercise, huh? Oh, your puppy. You do, 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 yeah. Mm -hmm. Hey, YouTube. We're uh, up by my favorite camping spot if it ever opens up again. Oh, look at that. They've been at it, ruining the forest. Yeah, we're uh, up here, uh, my favorite site that I saw last time. Right up here, there's a waterfall. And if this loop ever opened again, this would be a bitchin' site to camp at. Because it's, uh, I followed it, I hiked it up one time. And um, I thought I was going towards uh, a different way. I thought I was going towards... Uh, what is that, Windy Gap? But it was actually going up towards uh, that spring where you take the uh, old uh, forest road up to um, South Mount Hawkins. It goes to that area up there. But uh, I didn't go all the way up because I had my wife and kiddos with me. But yeah, Lulu's having fun. She is in tune, this little pup. She is uh, nine months old, and uh, she was stray, and she had pups at nine months. I didn't know dogs. Uh, I don't know dogs can have babies at that age. Anyways, I'm gonna check it out here. She's just frolicking in the snow, aren't you, Lulu? What are you digging? What are you digging? What do you got? Huh? What do you got? Right. Yeah, storm did. Blow some rocks, uh, or push some rocks over here. That's so crazy, the power of water can move all this. Down the mountain slope, down this. They cleared, they had cleared this out, but as you can see, it's creeping back in. This is a massive pile of dirt, just can move, can move my water. Shows you the power of Mother Nature. Very cool. Now all the snow's melting out the trees, so it sounds like it's raining. It feels like it's raining. If you get up further on the top over there on the mountain, there's still snow on the trees, snow and ice. That'd be more dangerous up there right now because uh, when it heats up, the ice uh, that forms on those trees can drop down. If it hits you on the head, no bueno. Not good. Oh, full waterfall there. Ah, it's such a beautiful day to be out here in the uh, Crystal Lake Recreation Area. Look at this big old beast. But it's a rock. Came down from up there. I wasn't down here last time I came up here. I Made mean, a good thud. <laughs> oh, yeah. Thank you, view. Check it out. Look at that. Winter Wonderland up there. 
apologize for the shakiness. I don't have my using my old uh, backup camera. I don't have the stabilizer for the other one. So I gotta find it. Yeah. Damn, that's beautiful. Yeah. Not Very even like cool. two minutes, and look at the cloud cover over here. Just disappeared. Crazy. Look at that. An obstructed view of uh, the mountain range. Uh, let's see if you can see it up here. Right there, that line. Cutting through the mountain range right there. That is the old fire road uh, that would go up to South Mount Hawkins where there was a fire lookout up there. You can see the line right there, center of the screen. Um, basically that. Um, yeah, it was just a fire lookout that uh, burned down in the 2002 uh, curve fire. If you go up there, I found cool little uh, shards. Uh, well, not really shards, but molten glass. It looks really cool. Hey, get down. Um, yeah, look at that view. The marine layer down there. So cool, right? Uh, right down there, center screen, that is the Pinion Ridge Trail. Goes down a little bit, probably where these, behind these two trees, there's a bench that overlooks the, uh, Highway 39 road. Very cool. Very easy trail. I've taken my kiddos on it, uh, numerous times. So it's a family friendly trail if you're looking to do that. Uh, over in this range is the Tortuga or Tortuga Trail or something. I don't know how they pronounce it but uh, it's kind of the same thing as the Pinion Ridge Trail. It's a, a loop and um, it just kind of goes up over this uh, little hillside here briefly and then goes back down. Back in you know what, I might take this trail up and then go down to Deer Flats. There's a spring and we might be lucky to see some deer. Look at this. Wow. Haven't seen this before. But no doubt it's possible because water uh, pushes all this stuff down. Look at this, this is a waterfall. Crazy. Whoa! Whoa! Getting snowed on here. Alright, we gotta get going over there. This little first junction. So you can take this down and this will go to the, the parking lot over there. Where I'm parked at. And uh, you can take this road. This will go to Deer Flats Campground. And then you can take this up. This will go to a second little junction. Which splits off and you can take the trail to Windy Gap up there, or Big Cienega, or South Mount Hawkins, or uh, make a left and you go to Deer Flats. So, I think we're gonna go up this way because I kind of want to see the spring and uh, head down. So, we'll go up this way. Let me show you it. This will intersect another uh, dirt road, the old service road to. Um, uh, South Mount Hawkins. So it's about 0.7 miles up there. And then uh, from there you have your choice which way you want to go. Uh, Deer Flats from this point looks like Look at this mile view. <sighs> Not sure what that's called over there, but when that snow melts, there's a cool rock uh, coloring formation. One side of it's a bright orangish color. The other side's a, a bluish gray uh, hint or hue to it. Very cool. <clears throat> Beautiful day. Beautiful day. And after this, I might stop by the cafe. There's a cafe up here. 
Crystal Lake Campgrounds. For those of you who haven't been up here, uh, they serve a really good food. They have a really bomb grilled cheese that I usually get. They have a chili cheese uh, uh, Frito, Frito pie type of deal. And uh, really big breakfast burritos. I haven't had one yet, I might get that. And um, some other stuff. He serves a really friendly guy, Adam, he's the owner. And he also has a few cabins that you can rent out and stay the night up here. Very cool. If you look it up, Crystal Lake Recreation Area, you'll find it. Very friendly guy. I love this area. Alright there YouTube, made it. Second Junction. Crystal Lake, 2.1 miles. We need to grab trailhead. So up to this point, it's 1.1 mile. Uh, Deer Flats Campground, 0.6 miles. We're going that way. There's a cool little spring I want to check out. Sounds like it's flowing. But check out this view, man. Beautiful. Up there's Windy Gap. Check it out, you two. Wow, this is new. So this happened pretty recently because when I brought that e-bike up here to test it out, this was not here. Look at this. Massive trees fell on the area. It looks like there's two. This one and one behind it. Look at that. Wow. This is uprooted and it fell. This thing was dead anyways, but oh no, it doesn't. It looks like it was still alive. Still got a little bit of green branches on it. I wonder what happened. Probably a bark beetle or something? Maybe? Crazy. Or it was Sasquatch. Yeah, Sasquatch. He pushed over the tree. Look, it must have been like that. So it must have been partially alive. I bet you it was a bark beetle. Anyways. Yeah, that's crazy. Yeah, spring's right in there. You see it? I don't want to go up there because it's uh, all freaking wet. Uh, let's see where is it at. If I can zoom in on it. Are you drinking water? Good girl. Hold on. Alright, let's see. Oh, here we go. Right there. A little spring. Uh, so that's a good clean source of water if you're up here. Last time I was up here, there were some deer up here. I'm not sure what this one's called. I don't know if it's Cedar Spring or Deer Spring. I'll have to look it up, but I'll put it on the, the, the video. I'll have it across the screen. Yeah, so this is a old uh, group campground uh, that closed off. Um, I don't know when they plan to reopen or if they do, but I'm assuming that they are planning because after the 2002 curb fire, they built this new restroom. Why would you put in funds? There's set, there's two of them up here. To uh, why would you put in the funds to not open it or save this area? I hear a waterfall. Pretty cool, you got two big grills, water station, cooking prep station, tables. The only bad thing about this, these sites is that there's not like a big footprint to put your tent if you have a big tent. 
So uh, theoretically, if you're doing the group campground, you're gonna have some a lot of equipment set up. So, but other than that, I mean, it's a peaceful, serene area. Sunset Ridge. Some loud ass birds up there. Alright, come on, dog dog. I'll film when we get up there. And here we are. Sunset Ridge Trail. It leads to this bench. Which I thought was redone. That doesn't look redone. Hmm. I don't know. Unless there's another one or something. Interesting. There's Pinion Ridge Trail. Very cool. Right, uh, let me see, where is it? There, those dead trees, that's what the bark beetles doing to them. They sprayed them recently, so hopefully that contains them. All right, so I'm just feel chilling a couple feet from that where that bench was. I thought the bench was a little bit taller, but it's like literally right on the ground. <laughs> Yeah, this is a little bit better, I think. Out in the sun, look at all that view. Look at that. Can't beat it. Cannot beat it. And, uh, you know, celebrate a little bit. What a perfect way to celebrate then some hard ass Mountain Dew. Yeah. Mm mm mm. Yeah. Hot ass Mountain Dew on top of a mountain. Okay, get off me, dog. <laughs> Jeez, what are you doing? <laughs> Dang. This is nice, though. This is nice. Cobbled together. And the snack. We got some jerky, teriyaki, beef jerky, and some um, seaweed. So I'm gonna eat a little bit, chill. I might go check out that uh, the sound of water over there by the uh, Deer Flats campground. And then I'll head back down. Very peaceful, very serene up here. Wow, 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 yippee oh, yippee eh? Lulu's up in the house. Yeah, so I wish I brought my uh, binoculars, but kind of give you a reference of where everything's at from me at this vantage point. Uh, let's see here. Where are we? We're just beyond this little hill, that roadway there. <laughs> Barely see it, but that is Glendora Ridge Road that traverses the mountains all the way up over to Mount Baldy. Um, let's see, right there, 
center of the screen that is I believe the 57 freeway going towards Orange County um, on a clear day you'd be able to see Catalina but today it's cloudy I don't think you can see much let me see uh, you can't really see can't make it out Sometimes you can see Pudding Stone. I don't see it over here. Probably looking at Ontario, Chino area. A little windy out. But yeah, we're just chilling here. I'm uh, about ready to pack up and head down and uh, grab some grub. But yeah, this is a cool, a cool little hike. Nice uh, day to get out and experience uh, this beauty after the recent storms. And yeah. We're out of here. Uh, picked up all our trash, left nothing, and uh, we're off. Head back down, get some grub. I might stop at the cafe and get some grub. And yeah, this is a fun little journey. Um, as far as hiking right now, probably in a couple days it might be a little bit better. A lot of this snow is turning to mush, so my socks got wet. Um, so maybe it would be best to hike a little bit in a couple days when it's more melted. But yeah, this is fun. That's, uh, again, that says the Sunset Ridge Trail up here at Deer Flats Campground and uh, Crystal Lake Recreation Area. Yeah, that's it. That's the end of the Sunset Ridge Trail. Back to Deer Flats.
Lulu. <laughs> Look at that happy dog. Yeah, happy dog and run. Happy dog and run. Whoa, rocket dog. Rocket dog. Burning down the kills and bits. He's a rocket dog. Alright, here's the source of that water. Right up there. This is a seasonal waterfall, I think. And uh, a couple of years, two, three years ago, I think it took out this section of the road. So they would have to repair this thing before they open it. That looks weird though, because it almost looks like... Uh, it almost looked like that was a, another little goalie. Who knows? Maybe one day in the future this will be opened. Lulu! Who's your puppy dog here? Ooh, you push. Anyways, yeah, that's what I wanted to check out, so now that I've seen that, I will get back down the, to the car. <laughs> she is just loving this. And it's a good thing she knows her name in response to the man. Lulu! Alright, there, YouTube, we made it back down, back to the car. So, that was the um, hike up to. Uh, Deer Flats River, uh, let me see, right up about here, Sunset Ridge from right up there. But uh, yeah, I need time to go get some grub. I'm sure this dog is tired, dog is barking. <laughs> and uh, yeah, thanks for uh, watching. GI Ranger 77 out.